I've been dating the same person for six months and I'm not bored yet? Oh no. Oh no. I'm in love, man. How could I let this happen? Okay, yes, I have started a wedding-themed Pinterest board, even though we've only been dating for three months, but you know what? Weddings take planning. I need to get out in front of this thing as early as possible. Now, will you be having the chicken or the sea bass? I don't get it. I've lost all interest in playing video games by myself and just want to spend all my time with this other person. Am I okay? Should I see a doctor? I love you. Okay, uh... Is this a joke? I know we like to joke around, but this is one of those times where it's like, if I'm suddenly sincere and say, I love you back, but you're joking, it's gonna be really unfunny. So I'm trying to figure out if I should dismiss this in a witty way or not. I am so head over heels, I planned out an entire date night. I put things on a schedule, a whole evening that wasn't left up to spontaneous decisions. What have I become? Okay, we have reached the phase of the relationship where we have fallen in love with each other, so now I suggest we wait six months to a year to see if we can still stand to be together once the rush of dopamine and oxytocin has worn off. I knew I was in love when I tried to break up with her, but she destroyed my argument with facts and logic. I can't let that kind of brain get away from me. I got us tickets to see the opera, your favorite. I'm very excited for this engaging and entertaining experience of watching people scream for three hours in a foreign language. I also have your favorite candies ready to sneak in. I was at the store, so I just did all your grocery shopping for you. It's no big deal. It is a little heavy on the chocolate, though. By that, I mean there's nothing but chocolate. But you know what? You'd look good with a few extra pounds on you. All my friends and family said I must be in love, so I guess I am. How do you think I feel? I think about her from the moment I wake up to the moment I go to sleep. She's my favorite person in the whole world and I can't live without her. So if you're gonna put a gun to my head, then yeah, I guess I'm in love. But why put labels on our feelings, man? Doesn't that just cheapen them? My actions have been entirely divorced from what is rational and efficient. I spent 90 bucks on dinner and drinks for just the two of us the other night. Me, 90 bucks, with no threat of jail time compelling me. She cooked me dinner for the first time the other night. Mashed potatoes from a box, Brussels sprouts, bland, no flavor, and the chicken was raw. It was the best dinner anyone's ever made for me. She is just so amazing. I mean, she's got a lot of very deep character flaws and there are some major red flags that I am ignoring, but I see the potential. She just needs someone to save her from herself. Do you know when I knew I loved you? It was when you chewed out my coworker Timmy for being a clueless ding dong before I had the chance to chew him out myself. It was a truly magical moment. I am so in love. Oh, not with my girlfriend. I'm talking about the ideal version of a partner that I've had in my head since I was 12. I'm really just kind of waiting to see if my girlfriend can ever live up to that. I've got a brand new design on a lot of different items as well as a special holiday design. Check out the links below the video. You could be repping your favorite YouTube channel, which is this one.